Hi, Dreamers! Welcome back to Dreamers Radio. And right now, we have special guest star from Thailand, Billy Bird. Hi! Hello! Hi, Hi Billy Bird. Nice to meet you. It's really nice to meet you. How are you guys? We're doing awesome. This awesome right. morning has been awesome. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Are you in Thailand right now, guys? Or maybe... Yes, yeah, yeah. Oh, we're okay. we're at we're back home. Oh, okay, nice. Okay, uh, so before we going to start our interview, uh, can you please say hi to our listener called Dreamers? Hello, Dreamers. Hi, Dreamers. We're Dreamers as well. <laughs> okay, everyone is Dreamers as well. Okay, but Milo, I think your mic is unmuted. Sorry about that. Hello, Dreamers. We're Tilibus. Hello, Billy. Hello, Milo. Hello, Turd. Okay, by the way, I want to say congratulations on your new single, Retro 39. Congratulations. Terima kasih. Oh, terima kasih, Kapun Ha. Right? Is my pronunciation right? Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, okay. So, before we start our interview, uh, can you please introduce yourself first? Uh, hello, we're Tilly Bird. I'm third. I am the lead vocals. Hello, third. Hello, Dreamer. I'm Billy. Hi, Billy. I'm Milo. I'm Tilly Bird. Okay, hi, Milo. Okay, besides uh, promoting your new single, Retro 39, uh, what are you busy right now, guys? Um, With the album, of course. Yeah, we're... <laughs> On the <laughs> last stop, uh, on um, uh, making it last stop, Ooh. meaning last two songs, I think. <laughs> yeah, okay, okay, okay. So maybe Billy has another answer or Milo. Yes, um, we um, sometimes it's not good to have too much time on our hands, so we do have extra time for this album so we just kind of we plan we revisited um the album and ended up adding more songs so that's why it's the last stop oh okay that was really excited right so um can you tell us about your new single retro 39 guys yeah it's a uh, a groovy track you know I was, uh, you know we were thinking to have we, we, we were thinking we're missing, you know, this kind of sound, this kind of song in our album. And so uh, Billy Milo uh, made this beautiful music. And I just thought of the simplest thing to say about, uh, which is missing someone. And that's what the song basically talks about. And the idea of having a retro 39 in the song is Billy's. Yeah, he, he was looking for... Uh, you know the missing verse in our in our line. You know we were looking for some words that would rhyme with uh, "relive the love you left behind," and so we were missing the last five syllables <laughs> in that verse and put it on retro thirty nine. You know, Billy thought Billy, Billy came up with that, and so we got this retro kind of concept thing going on, and so that became the sound. Oh, okay, nice. Who has the first idea to uh, produce this song? Who's um, one answer? We, Milo and I, we 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 kind of like came up with the um the first um bit together. Oh, um, Milo was on his system. I had my own system. Like I brought my like um my laptop and like my portable um monitors, and I put it right next to Milo's monitors and we like work separately but together you know oh yeah wow so that's how we started oh okay okay is no, there any fun fact difficult... about that, you know, they, they, fun fact about that they were bringing uh their speakers and so Milo's got a pair of his yeah. and Billy brought a pair of his and so we got four <laughs> speakers and so the original lyrics of uh of retro the night is Put it on double speakers because they were there, and I, you know, I was just randoming about the lyrics because mm-hmm. you have to put something in the song as, mm-hmm. as a dummy demo, and so <laughs> I just, I, I just wrote 
put it on double speakers. And so they were asking, so what's the song about that? I was like, double speakers. Yeah, because <laughs> because there are double speakers on, 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 on the desk. <laughs> That's the original yeah, lyric. Okay, okay. <laughs> Is that what well, that was a fun fact yeah about this single okay uh, by the way guys uh, is there any difficulties when you make these songs mm, i would say not really but uh, um but it tends to build up towards the end like um like this kind of songs is it has to start out really fun and it did but um but to keep that energy moving forward and also in order to perfect the song um it's really like a contrast you know like you trying to be perfect but you try to like let loose and be have fun i think that's the, that's the difficult part and and in the end it's kind of like built up towards that and um it builds up on like um the writing aspect and also on the production aspect as well oh okay okay is there any uh difficult this part from milo or a third i think this um for arrange arranging part is not that hard i guess because like um we created with really like fluently for 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 the song i i think and we just have fun yeah that that that's probably one um um one of the funniest part of making this song is just just writing it just write everything that we um thinking of yeah especially the the retro 39 thing that beliefs came off yeah yeah there's a moment that is really fun on this project yeah okay okay nice okay so uh, what are you guys feels after release this new single retro 39 very good we felt very good because we finally got to release it uh you know the project got delayed a bit you know but but you know finally it's out and we're just happy seeing the fans be able to sing it you know right away from listening to it just a few times and they enjoyed the music video uh you know the the great part about this is that once the song is out you know we we released the chorus first you know bef a week before the whole song and they were already singing it Ooh. just the chorus <laughs> okay how's indonesia guys oh indonesian indonesian crowd is wild in a oh. good, in, in best of ways like yeah 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 you know it was almost like a culture shock but in in, in, in a good in a good way uh, seeing them jump with their phones, yeah, yeah. Because I, I know they wanted to film, but they were like, "Yeah, yeah, like, that's yeah, Indonesian culture." Yeah, this is what we're yeah. talking about. That that tweet, man, that tweet. We have yeah. to find that tweet and give it to you guys. That tweet tells oh. the whole story. Oh. Yeah, we that was one tweet of this um um <laughs> one of the wow. audience um who filmed. Mm -hmm the um actually the very last bit of the concert and um she kind of like screams her lungs out and um you know like and i'm um, like head banging with her friends like switching uh... switching angles <laughs> well, that that video you have to see that video that video yeah. will, will do everything about how that concert went and um how the um indonesian crowd were you know yeah, yeah, Indonesia yeah. love so much about concert, and then when there's like concert, they're gonna like super vibing it, and then they're gonna yeah. like scream loud. Yes, that Indonesian. <laughs> it was uh, quite refreshing for us, and in, in best of ways, yeah. Okay, 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 guys. Um, is there any food Indonesian food that you want to try, guys? Mm -hmm. I mean, we tried a lot, but um, I mean. Mm -hmm. They might already know this, but we love ah. Martabak. Martabak? Martabak, yes. Yeah. Oh. Oh. We love Martabak. Okay, another... Uh, have you ever tried sate? Oh, of course, Martabak. of course. Oh, yes. Yes. Oh. Sate Sanayan. 
Satisfying isn't, isn't here. Yeah. Isn't here. If it comes to dreamers, we're going to give satisfaction. Exactly one that three of us agree. Maraba for me is kind of like yes or no, but stack yes, sate yes. Satisfaction. Yeah. Yeah. Mar- Matarbak is like it's good for the first bite, and that's it. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay, it's... I can elaborate on that. that you know, the okay. first bite takes you to heaven, and the other will take you there. <laughs> I just feel bad for my <laughs> That's it. Yeah, I mean, you can do one bite. That's it. But yeah, um, yeah. but satay, you can do it all all yeah. day. Right. <laughs> but the for for me was quite um life changing because <laughs> I've never tasted any uh kind of candy or sweets uh, presented mm-hmm. that way and that big, you know, but. One piece was not enough for me. I had to get the whole box. Yes. And other than uh, Martha Buck, uh, Satay, there was this thing uh, with the rice and you eat with the hands. Nasi Padang? Yes, yes. Uh, I, I had that. And, and, and the, the buzz, sambal. The sambal. Oh, sambal, yeah. The sambal is full of spices. It gives you this. <laughs> Vibrant feeling. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry, I I just get carried away talking about food, but yeah, I love. We're going to bring you a lot of sambal if you come to Dreamers, okay? <laughs> Thank you. Go. Let's please uh promote your single to Dreamers, like where people can listen to your song. All streaming platforms, of course, and, and uh, hopefully Dreamers Radio would play it, or you guys can. Ask for a retro thirty nine on the station, and uh, just basically have fun with it. And hopefully, this will take you back to the good old times, good old days, and just relive it. Retro thirty nine. Okay. Is there any like YouTube channel or maybe Instagram that dreamers want to follow you? Where's they gonna search your name? Yes, uh, so Tilly Birds, yeah, they go everywhere for uh, our social media platforms, Facebook, Twitter, I'm sorry, X, <laughs> Facebook, X, Twitter is fine. Instagram, <laughs> um, <laughs> our website, we got our own official website, tillybirds.com. You can look for tour dates there or on other. Yeah, um, as well. if you want to go and hardcore, least, uh, go on <laughs> website. And um, yeah, that will be hardcore. tour dates, tour dates and merchandise and everything and all the oh. new. And sign up to our newsletters as well. Oh, okay. Please go check on their links, yeah, guys. Yeah, dreamers. Oh, no, TikTok as well. I'm sorry. Oh, TikTok. on TikTok too. Okay, okay. So dreamers, don't forget to follow them on any social media platform and also listen to their music. Okay, okay, Dreamers, thank you for your thank time you. today. Thank you so today much. we're having a good, great time. Okay, thank you. and. Thank you so much. Bye-bye. Kapun ha. Thank you.